Hello, this is Michael again with the Wupnik channel. Today is December 30th, 2017. So we have just another day to go yeah, to come into 2018. Well, let's see what uh, 2018 holds for us. As you can see, uh, since my last video, I let my beard grow. I have grown a beard and uh, yeah, it feels a little bit strange at times. So guys, what do you think? Uh, does it look good? Does it not look good? Does it make me look too old? It's always an issue here on YouTube, age. So what do you think guys? Shall I keep my beard or shall I just shave it off? Look what I have here. This is the Madventure 360. It is a 360 degree camera, which means it takes photos and videos from all around the camera. It's kind of nifty. So what I will do today is I will unbox it. Of course, unboxing is always fun. And then I will, uh, of course, review it. I will introduce to uh, you to, uh, to this camera. And then I will go out, take some videos, see what's going on. Of course, I also will try to uh, create some tiny planet videos and photographs. And uh, well, then we can finally come to a conclusion. Is it just a toy? Well, it looks a little bit like a toy. It's orange. Is it just a toy? Or is it actually something you can use for something more serious? So as you can see, uh, this little camera comes with quite a lot of stuff. Yeah, here is of course a selfie stick. You need a selfie stick and it is very light. Yeah, I mean, look at it, it's nice. It's very narrow here to connect to the uh, uh, 360 camera. And you see those connections here, those contacts. Yep, you can actually turn the camera on and off, recording on and off, just here by pressing this button. No uh, remote control needed, nothing. And of course, this camera is uh, programmed so that later when you film with it, yeah, this selfie stick is just disappearing. Yep, magic. Yeah, and uh, when you expand it, extend it, yeah, yeah, extend it, or oh, it's nice aluminum. It is, it feels very rigid and uh, yeah, it's, it's nice. Huh? It doesn't even fit here totally onto the video. Yep, let's put this one back together. All right, and then here we have something really nice. Let me see if you can, can see that. So you see this little gadget here? Yeah, when I screw it onto this little camera, then uh, the uh, Madventure 360 becomes compatible with a lot of GoPro st uh, stuff. And as, as you might know, I have a lot of GoPro stuff. So this is really nice. Then of course we have a pouch here. It's a nice and rugged pouch. It feels good, it's fantastic. And of course here, micro USB. It's a micro USB cable for, for charging. I don't know why they are still using micro USB. Yeah, why not USB-C? This is so much nicer, so much really nicer. And of course here is a booklet and it is a uh, let's get started booklet. So, I mean, this is actually something you can read. It is not just a piece of paper folded 10 times. And of course, also it's in English, not in Chinese. So it's, it's a very, very nice package. 
So here you can see what I meant that with this little uh, dongle, this adapter, uh, the uh, adventure camera can also use everything, not everything, but lots of stuff from the GoPro Hero line. Here, for example, I have attached uh, the Madventure 360 to a baseball cap, a baseball cap which has here uh, the mount for a GoPro camera. And you see, yeah, it, it, it works perfectly. Yeah, it looks nice, huh? So I don't know if this is high enough to have uh, a nice 360 video or 360 photo. I will figure it out, I will find out. Yeah, and uh, in regards to orange, you see, if this here would be black, it would be not so conspicuous. People would not look at it so much. Yeah, can you imagine what happens when I, for example, walk into Union Station in downtown Los Angeles with a black baseball bat, a hat, and I have this orange thing here on top? I might get here in, into trouble. Yeah, what is that? Well, it's my it's it's my 360 camera. Yeah, so I don't know. So let's see what's happening. Yeah, but so far I am uh, quite uh, positively impressed by this camera, except for the orange. So here it is. Here is the Madventure 360 in all its glory. Yeah, again it is orange. So, yeah, this is actually uh, an evolution, an evolutionary product of, a, uh, of another camera, or maybe you can say it's a rebranding of another camera, but uh, what I read is the tech specs of this camera here are better than uh, from the other camera. Yeah, there is right now what you can buy a, from a Chinese company, a camera which is called a Xiao, me my sphere so it's it's a little bit hard for the western tongue and this camera is also in black and uh, this Chinese camera original Chinese camera does not have all the stuff here it is pretty much just the camera so this here I would assume is a uh, entry an entry product for the western market United States uh, and uh, and Europe and but I just don't know why is they made it orange. As, as I said, the original Chinese version is black. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's a nice orange, but when you have any experience with taking pictures in a crowd, you are walking down the street with a camera, yeah, you do not want to uh, raise any attention. Yeah, it's just not good. I have been kicked out out of so many places because I had, a, of course, a bigger camera like this one with me, and now this one is orange. Yeah, this really yells. Hey, I'm here, I'm filming you, kick me out. So there was quite a lot in the package. Yeah, first of all, uh, here is the camera itself. You see how flat it is. Yeah, the, the flatness, to call it like that, yeah, will help uh, later with the stitching. Yeah, those two lenses take independent video, which has to be stitched together later. Don't worry about it. There is an app for that. Okay, so uh, as you can see here, the camera comes with a little tripod, which actually feels kind of sturdy. Yeah, it's not some, some cheap junk, it is a nice tripod, and when you fold it up, then you actually have, have a little grip here. Then you can run around and so on. Yeah, so it's, yeah, this is nice. Yeah, so and of course it's a very minimalistic camera. Yeah, it's uh, but from the minimalistic standpoint, it looks it looks great. Yeah, so it's just it's orange. I mean, it's yeah orange. I don't know. So not only the design of the camera is minimalistic, uh, also how to use it is minimalistic. Uh, the whole camera has only three buttons, yeah, which is enough to do the minimum stuff. Yeah, here, this button, can you see it? Can you see it? This button is on off. This button here is to connect to Wi-Fi. And here, of course, this is a button to take pictures or start the video or stop the video. Yeah, so 
So it's, yeah, that's basically it. You want to do more with this camera, you have to download the app from, uh, from the App Store and uh, then you have a much nicer interface. But for a camera like that, you want to create 360 videos with, it's, it's enough, yeah, it's, it, it's nice. So, and then here on the side you see a micro USB port to charge the internal battery, which cannot be removed. And there is also the slot for the micro SD card. I will put in here a 64 gigabyte SD card. This camera only takes one SD card, which is of course good. Yes, for example, uh, the GoPro Fusion uh, requires two SD cards. So this is a little bit odd. So while this video is an un unboxing video, I still would l uh, like to give you my first impressions of this camera. So let's go a little bit into uh, the uh, technology behind it. So again, this is a 360 degree camera. It has, f it is 4K. So you know 4K from TVs and cameras. So this is a very nice resolution for a TV. But 4K for, uh, for a 360 degree camera is, uh, how do I say it nicely? Mm, yeah, 4K for a 360 degree camera is not good. Yeah, you must you must see the uh, the following. When you have a normal uh, 4K camera and you want to see something on a 4K TV, this is great. Yeah, the camera points into a uh, 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 in, into an area, into a direction, and just takes a cut from this whole picture. Yeah, just one little box out of it, and that in 4K is of course great. But this camera records everything around you, everything. And 4K for everything around you is just not good enough to have a nice resolution. I have not tested it yet, yeah, but I'm just uh, telling you the uh, uh, theory behind uh, the stuff. So 4K is is all right. For example, the uh, GoPro Fusion has 5.7K. Yeah, this here is 4K. Uh, again, for this price point, it's, it's not bad. So I'm sure that this camera will do some decent uh, 360 degree video. So my friends, that's it for today. This was the unboxing and first impression of the uh, Mad Venture 360 another Chinese quality product. Yeah, actually, it, it, it actually feels a little bit like quality. I mean, I have so far not found anything negative about this camera, except for it is orange and it has only a, a micro USB port, not a USB-C port. So these are the uh, two downsides. I will now test the camera so that I can create a review video for, uh, for you guys. And please, when you like the video, please like it and don't forget to subscribe, okay? Support my channel, subscribe. It is really important. Yeah, what else? Well, you have any questions about this camera, write it in the comments. As soon as I can, I will answer all your questions. All right, well, this is Michael with the Wupnik channel. It is December 30th, 2017. One more day to go and we have a new year. And uh, just in case I don't produce the uh, review video for this camera this year, I wish you all out there in the world a happy new year 2018. All right? Okay, well, that's it. Let's see what we can do in 2018. Subscribe.
And friends, please don't forget, I bought this camera, the Madventure 360, with my own money. Yeah, I did not receive any money from the manufacturer and there is no ads running on this video or anywhere on my channel. Yeah, so I am not making any money out of it. When I give you my opinion about something like the Madventure 360, it is my real opinion. Yeah, when it's a piece of crap, a piece of shit, I will tell you. When it's something good, something wonderful, I will tell you, okay?